Hello there, Alicia here. A very, very happy holiday season. I like Christmas, don't get me wrong, but I work in retail, and it's Christmas, and we're busy. So the other night I accidentally, on purpose, maybe, I don't know, call it the holidays. So happy holidays to you. Mm. But before I talk about all my misadventures, I'm a geek. Why? Because I own a YouTube t-shirt. How is that a YouTube t-shirt? It's just a dancing cat. Well, at the end of the number two most subscribed uh, YouTuber channel thingamabob, Ray William Johnson, he has the question comment of the day, and there's a cat, and there's a song, and that cat, which is on my shirt, is on his videos. Every single one of them. So, I'm officially a YouTube nerd. Yeah! Also, I'm wearing antlers. So, crazy adventures. I went to go see Harry Potter. Loved it. Loved it. Really excited for the next one. It was kind of a slow movie, but good. And important, I'm sure. I have not read the books. I can't read the books to save my life. Um, also, in case you were wondering, Hufflepuff. The next morning I have a meeting for the other job. I swear I set my alarm. The alarm didn't go off because I misset it. That's what happens when you go to a movie that late at night. And my mom comes down the hallway about, what, 9 o'clock? I was supposed to be there at 8. She's just, oh my gosh, she got a call. So I get on the phone with the manager. Long story short, it wasn't okay that I missed the meeting and I got fired. <laughs> Little, you know, it's for the best. Uh, juggling two jobs at once probably wouldn't have been a good thing. So I had to cancel the uh, s'mores party. I'm okay. I'm okay. I swear. There, you know, there'll be other s'mores parties. So, uh, Rachel has moved. I don't. I don't think I've mentioned Rachel. Rachel's somebody I went to high school with. She had a baby recently, so we had a little uh, baby shower. Then I got to see them off to LAX, and I felt very, very handy that day. Good. Dude. I totally shot an engagement session, and it was amazing because my clients really, really, really wanted to go up to the snow, and I was like, why not? I've got time. So we went up to the snow, and I shot some photos, and they love them, and I love them, and it was so much fun. It was so cute. It was so pretty. It was kind of different than most of the stuff I've ever done, um, engagement session-wise. So Wednesday of just last week, I was in the studio, and it felt so good. Five girls three makeups and hairs each. My photographer probably shot close to 2,000 or more. StyleMePretty.com, WeddingChicks.com, those images that are kind of like holiday, party, whatever, whatever. I helped out. I haven't been in the studio in probably about three or four years with the whole backdrop and the pocket wizards and the whole nine yards. And my goodness, I love you, Teen Harry Makeup. That's the name of the company that um, I worked with. Mm -mm. Dance break. Mm -mm. Dance break. Dance break. Well, I think of what I'm gonna say. Oh, I got to see another super duper weird, awesome, crazy, insane out there. I don't even know what I was watching when I was watching it, but I was smiling and laughing. It was called Surviving Life. It's a Czechoslovakian film. Saw it out in Hollywood. I'd see it again in a heartbeat. It had like stop motion photography mixed in with live action, whatever. And it was about dreams. I'm Czechoslovakian, by the way. So yeah, it was like my roots. I'm glad I got the opportunity to go. Real film, like artful, awesome, crazy. Ah, enough of that. Last night, I got to go see Black Swan, the Darren Aronofsky movie. The film had film grade, and the costumes, and the makeup, and Darren Aronofsky is pretty darn amazing. If I'm not mistaken, he did Requiem for a Dream, and he did Pi. So, if you liked those films, you will like this It's It's psycho. Last week, I tried to go out with some friends and go do some karaoke, and it didn't exactly work out, which, you know, happens. After Black Swan, totally went to a bar, and they just so happened to have karaoke. Yes! I haven't done karaoke since I left Florida, and I, of course, did the song that I always do, Blind Melon. No rain. Heck yeah. What? The other night I got to see Rockapella. 
Now, if you were a kid in 1998, you probably watched a good amount of PBS. I didn't anyway. So you watched a show called Where in the World is Carmen San Diego? If you listened at all to any of the music in that show, you listened to a Rockapella. They did their holiday song. They did Rudolph. I hate Rudolph because my worst, most embarrassing moments of life has to do with that song. I will say no more. You better all not comment. Those of you who know the story, I will come and hunt you. And we did the encore thing. We clapped so much they had to come back on. And we made them sing Where in the World is Carmen kind of San Diego. Happy girl. I did a little dance. Kind of like the one that I just did right now. Making sure that I haven't missed anything. I went on a cupcake mission. I love cupcakes. Nom 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 nom. I'm probably not going to see you for another few weeks until all the crazy holidays dies down. Happy Hanukkah, I know that was past, but Merry Christmas, Happy Ramadan, Merry Kwanzaa, and there's another holiday I know in there, but I don't remember. And I'll see you in the new year. You are bodacious. I am hella bodacious. Together, there is much bodaciousness.